Well, anyways, I tried to do a live, finish up my live video from yesterday. And uh, my service is not working good outside the house. Keeps kicking me off. So this is the need. This is a needle and see for I'm bringing crap. And I got it already in, but I can take it back apart for you. Just so you know. If I can get it apart. Probably can't get it apart because I'm trying on the camera. Yeah. I put most of the tools away yesterday when I got done. Apologize, apologize, apologize. So, so, yeah. So this is a new needle and seed, and the seed's down in the bottom already. See the orange thing? I was saying something pertaining to that I thought there was full of rust, thinking that the already thinking that there was an orange seat down in the bottom but the camera didn't pick it up and uh, well I dug the other one out threw it in a box so I could show you guys after here it is here's the old one here's the old one I'll, hopefully I won't drop it again here's the old one and On that side, you probably can see a ring around there. A little, see the little ring? That goes down in. So, that goes down in the hole. That hole down there. The bottom one. And, you know, I can use... I mean, you know, I don't have all these fiscade tool, tools. So, I just use a simple little nail. Little nail. So, just jam it in there big time. And then you can just slide it down in the hole. Let's just slide her down in the hole like that. And you're going to have to wiggle a little bit because she see how she's stuck on there. She's not stuck on there a lot, but just enough. See what I'm saying? And she'll take off on you if you're not careful. Like I said, there's good in the bad. Good in the bad. That side you can see the ring. And this is the old one. See the ring on it? Yeah. That's the ring. Then you just slide her down in the hole. Wiggle a little bit till it falls off, and then I just use three sixteenths um, to push it down and seat it. Like I said there's a tool with a little nib nibble on the end, nipple on the end that slides down in there, so you can just slide it down perfect. I don't have that. I even looked at one; it was like ten bucks, but uh, then I got to turn around and wait for it. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? So anyways, I got this guy together. Together, slid her back in here. Back in there like that. I'm not going to use the old gasket. I see the floats avail uh, not available local. It's like eight, ten buck. Um, I got to order ten something or other actually. I think it was ten bucks. Ten, a little over ten buck for that. And so I just put that back together like that. I cleaned the bowl out quite a bit. There's a little, a little bit of stuff in the bottom, but, uh, and if I use this at all, if I use it at all, like I said, I already cleaned this out in the prior video, because it had some poo-poo in the bottom of there, cleaned that all out. Put that needle on there, put that back on like this, tighten it back. It's going to kind of go rough together, because, because, uh, between the brass the brass and the aluminum they tend to uh, not like each other you know what I'm saying you know what I'm saying they don't tend to like each other it's like you know you know what I'm saying it's like a hug light a light a love like relationship kind of thing so then I just snuck around down, 
So now going around down and uh Yep. Just like that. That's all bad together. There is a number on this carburetor. There's a number right there. If, you, if that helps you out. That number right there. Alright. There you go. Now I gotta put it back on, so I'll bring it back when I put it back on.